Welcome to the Advice Show, Medio, the Common Sense Approach. So there were two men sitting down inside of the Waffle House trying to order them some food. And you had some drunk racists come inside that Waffle House spewing racial slurs at these men. And one of them tried to attack the black man. And the other friend tried to bum rush the black man as well. But see, they did not, they did not expect this brother to have a concealed carry permit. And one of the races was dealt with. A group of friends walk into a Waffle House in the early morning hours of January 5th. Right off the bat, you can tell something's off. Surveillance video shows a shirtless man, later identified as Dakota Fields, gesturing at someone or something. From another camera angle, you can see two men, Gerard Williams and Jorge Hernandez, sitting at the restaurant counter. According to a detective's incident report, Williams stated that Dakota Fields was yelling racial slurs at them. He then told the waitress to hurry up because it was time for him to go. Surveillance shows one of Fields' friends, Robert Black, approaching Jorge Hernandez and then shakes his hand. Black then tried to do the same with Williams, and you can see he has his hands crossed and shakes his head no. Robert Black then punches Williams in the face. Williams backs up and shows his gun. Seconds later, Dakota Fields runs back into the restaurant, charges at Williams, and then Williams pulls the trigger. Fields was shot three times. He and his friends then leave, and on their way to the hospital, their SUV crashes with another car. Fields was pronounced dead on scene. Documents show that after shooting Fields, Williams set the gun on the restaurant counter and called 911. He told the operator what had happened and that he acted in self-defense. He also had his concealed carry permit. When questioned by detectives, several other witnesses inside the Waffle House say Fields and his friends were acting drunk, confrontational, and unruly the night of the shooting. When Dakota Fields' friend Robert Black was interviewed by detectives, he told them that Williams had reached for a gun when he tried to shake his hand. Surveillance video showing that never happened, and he later admitted it was a lie. This is why I highly support concealed carry and I feel people should get one because stuff like this. Now, if he did not have his concealed carry permit and let's say if he did have a gun on him and shot him, he wouldn't be in jail right now. But having a concealed carry permit, having video evidence proving that they were the aggressors, they were just sitting there minding their own business, trying to eat some food. They come in there drunk and full of hate and they lost their life. I don't feel bad at all about that situation, not at all, because that could have turned out a different way, possibly if they didn't have some sort of weapon to defend themselves with. Now, the friends who survived, I bet they learned a good lesson, too. Now, go out in the middle of the night messing with people because you never know if they have a firearm or not. I mean, I don't understand why anybody do that these days personally, because if you would actually go to the gun range. And you look at how many people sit in those concealed uh, carry classes trying to get those permits. You will really think twice when you run up on people these days. I'm telling you. I mean, those classes are jam packed every time. So y'all keep doing that stupid stuff you want to run up on people and you get shot. It's on you because you shouldn't be trying to mess with people. Because in a lot of these states that have concealed carry and stand your ground laws, if it's self-defense, they're not going to jail. And that, that's clear cut self defense. We've seen the video on it. There's no way you could put uh, some lies to it because even the, the, the guys that was with the racists were trying to lie, and all that was refuted by video evidence. And this is why I'm a, I love video, I love audio, I love anything that to watch things because if they, let's say if they did not have this, it could have went a different way. Trust me, it could have. Hit me up in the comments, shoot the commentaries, subscribe.